<laughs> this is not a creepypasta video for Pokemon Black. I lied. But I will cover that sometime in the future, so... April Fools, suckers! Ha <laughs> ha! I can't do it. Well, I don't really want to leave you guys too empty-handed, so... We'll, we'll take a look at a troll pasta or a shitty pasta or whatever you prefer, I don't know. Called... Blow? Question mark, question mark, question mark. And here it is. I'm going to be completely honest with you. In this day and age, how can how the computers are so prominent in everything? I'm close to being clueless on how the things work. I'm not old, still young, but I'd rather not list my age on the internet. I'll just say, in my 20s. <laughs> yeah, sure you are. I want to tell you guys something that happened to me while getting accustomed to my new computer, a Windows 7. Try Windows 8. I was searching the libraries when something caught my eye. No, literally, something caught my eye, as in grabbed onto it. I tried to pull away, but I lost my eye in the process. I'm not sure what was tugging at, what was tugging at it, but the doctor told me to be careful with my last eye. So wait, 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 wait. You'd no longer have one eye just because something pulled it. Uh, how does that work? The next time I booted up my computer, the screen suddenly exploded and my other eye got damaged, along with my hand and my face was severely burned. Eventually, I called the doctor to take care of things. Hospitals have nurses who want to kill me. <laughs> that sounds like somebody who has a fear of hospitals. <laughs> and he banged me up. Banged me up. I went completely blind and he had a... a amputate some of my fingers. I was given no painkillers nor put to sleep while doing so. Wait, okay? What? Then I miraculously regained my sight. Woohoo! I got a new screen at Best Buy and hooked it up to my computer. Frightened as hell, I boot up only now to be greeted with an error message and my computer crashed. No, really, it fell and crashed onto the floor. Wait, okay? So I picked up and rebooted it and saw the library folder was gone. I had to look for it under the start tab. Alright. Browsing through the folder once, I noticed in the computer tab there was a file on the top. It was apparently a notepad named Read Me that wasn't there before. I clicked on it and began to read. Hello? Congratulations! You have unlocked a special easter egg! This gift is listed further down the list and labeled Blob. For some reason, the file extension wasn't listed. I looked down and found it. Blob? Question mark, question mark, question mark. Read the screen. All the files must have given an extension, right? Why doesn't this thing? Unless... Is one? Am I just an idiot? Well, if you were just to insult yourself, I wouldn't call you an idiot. I'd more call you a dumbass and a completely mentally retarded person. I just know that comment will get me in very big trouble. Apologies, Blaze. I, I'm sorry. Just trying to make a joke here. I'm sorry. I'll, shut I'll just continue reading now. I decided to click on it. It turned out to be some sort of video. A little black oblong ball that sat in the middle. It was white with brown, blue eyes with a background that looked like the sea. Its beady eyes stared at me and its mouth would open from time to time. The thing looked like some sort of Digimon or Pokemon. I don't know. It pretty much sat there for like a minute then weird stuff started to happen. My antivirus software told me that there was a virus and it was the video I was watching. I couldn't shut off the playback and my software failed to delete it. Then my desktop picture... It was of my cats. <laughs> Internet meme. <laughs> Began to be reddened. Soon the whole screen, including the taskbar, was blood red color. The video put itself on full screen mode. Music began to play in the background. It was light and happy. But there were a few notes sounded off. It slowly began to become very dark sounding. The creature started to blacken in the see in the sky surrounding it turned red. The water looked like blood. Then I heard loud screaming noises. It went 
deaf after that. I went deaf after that. Yeah, uh, are you gonna write something better? Then, like something out of a Digimon movie. How do you know? I've never seen a Digi Digimon movie. I've seen Pokemon movies, and they're all the same. But how how is it like something on a Digimon movie? There's only one that I know of. I'm not. A, I don't pay attention. The creature wiggled its way out of a computer and materialized it into our world. I quickly bit off my foot and hopped off to somewhere. I tried to catch it, but yeah, no, my foot. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I tried looking for the file, but it seemed to have vanished. I hope to find the video posted up long for it. For now, I use paint to show you guys what I saw. Although it may not be perfect, I'm hoping someone recognizes it. Well, I don't know, that picture actually looked pretty decent. I'm not sure what happened, but now thanks to me losing... Thanks to me, that thing is on the loose. If anyone had the same experience or has any idea what has happened, please tell me. Recently, I began taking computer classes. I'm looking through the computer programming itself to find any clues as to where I can find the file. I found clues to what the file really is and what its strategy, what it's called. Strangely, the com, the, is a comment in the programming that says, "Find me." And underneath is a series of random numbers consisting about a thousand lines. I figured out that bulb stands for the numbers. 2, 12, 21, 12, 2, like they are listed in the alphabet. I'm going to bet that once I find these numbers, I can retrieve the video or something else will explode. With regards, Mark. Okay. My... What did I just read? <laughs> I know it's a troll pasta or shitty pasta, whatever you prefer, I don't care. Uh, but, what? Is this how troll pastas work? Yeah, boy, I feel like a sap. Well, if, if I was to judge it as a pasta, I'd say, it is some sort of potential I could see. But it needs a lot more work. And... It was weird. Very weird. Well, happy April Fool's Day, or April Fool's! Bye-bye.